It was good, y'all. It's King Z, and I am back here on Payday 2 with another build for y'all. So, yeah, this is gonna be a holdout build. Um, this build was inspired by, I thought it was gonna crash right there, fucking Epic Wheels build. So, shout out to him. I'll put his, uh, his video in the description below because maybe y'all prefer that one instead i don't know that's the one i've been using for a lot of these infamy levels uh but um yeah i didn't like using his build these are the uh kimbo grims and i'm just just wasn't a fan of using those you know what i'm saying uh my build i will say the downsides of it but um yeah this build was inspired by uh epic wills um holdout build so yeah that's what i have right here on the right set on but um yeah that's the build I've been using, like I said, for a lot of my infamies. So I decided to make my own holdout build, kind of inspired by his with some different weapons and skills. So, um, yeah, let's get into this, man. I guess we'll start with the guns first. Gun, you just really want anything with a lower concealment, uh, because you want that, um, crit bonus. So as long as you have below five detection, you'll be fine. I was switching out between the cavity. I used the Heather's one game, my fucking... So you can pretty much use anything. I just kind of wanted to use the cavity just because it's a it's a cool gun, kind of underrated. You don't really see it too often, so I'm like, fuck it, I'll throw it in the build. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm running with. Uh, the only real downside to this is the terrible ammo pickup. You get about one bullet per um per ammo on the ground. So yeah, ammo pickup not very good. But you're not gonna be shooting that often. You know what I'm saying? Your bots are really gonna kind of carry you through a lot of these waves. You're just only gonna shoot enemies that are like either kind of overwhelming you or trying to get the hostage up out of there. So um, yeah, I've completed all nine waves using this build, and I was like level like 60 some. I don't know. You guys will see the gameplay. I'm not gonna put the full fucking holdout gameplay. Cause it's like 33 minutes or some shit like that. But yeah, I've completed all nine waves. First world bank on here should be able to do it. Most um holdout maps just fine if you're an experienced holdout player which i am not so yeah that should tell you something so anyways concealment boost on there uh shouldn't need it but yeah i have it on there tooth fairy suppressor because we do uh have suppressor skills just to get us below this um three concealment so that's pretty much all that does you can throw a gadget on there if you want probably a laser or something you don't want to increase your concealment by too much um, and no sight, so yeah, not many attachments on the cavity, but it has a lot of damage. And yeah, like I said, the only real downside is the terrible ammo pickup. For the secondary, we have a HE round judge. So you have HE rounds on there. Silent killer suppressor. Concealment boost. I have this compact laser module on there just because I like the way it looks. And yeah, no lower receiver or sight on that gonna be some flashbangs two-piece suit i don't know why my game keeps freezing like that whatever <laughs> doctor bag buzzer <clears throat> so yeah uh anarchist perk deck also so yeah that's what we running now into the skills here like i said this is kind of inspired by epic will's build so you know big shout out to him anyways and mastermind here basic combat medic ace quick fix combat doctor and inspire uh, Will did not have jokers. I always love having jokers just because they provide something else for the enemies to shoot And they give me a little bit of health regeneration, which I like so here we have basic force friendship ace confident joker partners in crime and Hostage taker just cuz like you probably don't even need this ace, but I just love having that fucking health regeneration So yeah, if you don't want a hostage taker, then you got 12 extra points to spend um like I said, though, you're going to be using this build not even at level 100. I was using it at like 60, 70, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, you're not even going to probably get all these skills for real if you're playing holdout. Anyways, basic underdog here. Ace resilience because flashbangs fucking suck and it gets you up to bullseye so you can headshot enemies and regen some armor. Uh, Ace scavenger here just to help a little bit with the ammo pickup. I did that later on, like after I hit 100, so yeah, you might not have that. Uh, you gotta kind of pick and choose your skills here, depending on what level you are, so, yeah. Basic study grip, basic fire control, and basic lock and load, just because I hate not being able to uh, fire my weapon while I'm sprinting, especially the judge, because uh, you, you're gonna want to make a lot of ammo runs using this build, you know what I'm saying, so having the judge out, shooting the enemies to kind of daze them, stun them a little bit, and pick up some ammo is really nice to be able to do, and fire control and study grip just get you up to that. And ghost here, we have basic duck and cover and aced parkour so we can sprint and reload and sprint in any direction, which I just fucking love doing. 
that's more of a personal preference thing. Don't really need that aced. Uh, here we have basic second wind, aced optical illusions to get our concealment down so we don't have to ace low blow, and that saves us a few skill points. And I just have basic high value target here, so like dozers that we mark and shit take more damage, so we're not gonna waste too much ammo on them because you are gonna wanna shoot some of these dozers because they will overwhelm your ass. And fugitive here, we have aced nine lives. Swan Song, and then we just have basic Feign Death and Messiah. Don't really need these two, but you know, Feign Death comes in clutch sometimes, and Messiah can also come in clutch sometimes. So, um, yes, the build kind of pick and choose your skills, um, put things in different places that you don't need if you want to, you know, take off some skills you don't need, replace them with something else. Um, in the gameplay, I did First World Bank. I have another gameplay multiplayer. This build is not made for the, the fucking people in multiplayer are fucking retarded, so. You know, I usually play holdout solo, first world bank for XP, so that's what I was doing. Uh, you kind of see in the gameplay how I have my bot set up. If you're on PC, just fucking hit Z to yell at your bot and it'll stay there if you don't know. So yeah, kind of set up your bots how I got them. While we're talking about bots, I forgot to add in the video before I started recording. So, uh, yeah, um... For the bot setup, I have two bots running the R93 and one running a Moscone. For the abilities, I have Quick, Piercing, and Inspiring. And then for the crew boost, I have Stockpiler, Accelerator, and Healer. So those are the weapons and uh, abilities and boosts you guys are going to want. So yeah, back to the motherfucking video. And they should carry you easily to at least wave 5. Then after that, you're going to want to start like helping them out, picking off some enemies here and there, you know what I'm saying? But trying to be conservative with your ammo at the same time. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna leave y'all with the gameplay. I have two, I think. The other one was a multiplayer gameplay. I think we traded the hostage, though, in that the, the teammates were kind of stupid. I actually think he might have went to cuss. I don't know what happened, but, yeah. Solo holdout build. Hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, switch anything around that y'all want. Sorry if I'm fucking up my words and shit, y'all. I just woke up not too long ago and stuff, so, yeah, I'm a little retarded right now. But, um, yeah. Anyways, enjoy the build. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Leave any, like things you'd change in the comments below so you can let motherfuckers know like what's good what's not all that shit but yeah leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you are new for more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next video